Hi lovies! Welcome back to my channel. So today's video is my first video for our wedding series. So before we start, if you're new to my channel, hello, welcome, my name is Jill. Here in my channel, I make motherhood and lifestyle videos. I do vlogs, cleaning, organizing, whole vlogs. So if you wanna, if you like those kind of content, make sure to subscribe and hit that notification so you don't miss out. Check out my Facebook, Instagram, the girl's Instagram account, and my TikTok account. There's a lot of account. <laughs> um, I post updates, pictures of our family, and I just want to be connected with you guys. I post matching outfit in the girls' Instagram account, so if you want to support the girls, follow them. Thank you. And if you like Target Shop With Me videos, I post that on my TikTok account. So if you're addicted to Target like me, check it out. Thank you. So yeah, this is our first, like, um wedding related video like wedding planning and stuff like that uh, i just want to share with you like the wedding process because i've been watching binge watching like brides planning their wedding and stuff like that and i don't know i, I enjoyed watching it so and also to to, doc, to document my you know journey of planning so yeah, a little background. We got engaged last year, um, I think September 2020, and we're planning to get married uh, next by next year, 2023, January. So we haven't booked anything yet, but um, soon uh, we're starting to get you know uh, touring venues. Um, booking like vendors and stuff like that. I just want to share with you like the motive, the theme that I have in mind. Um, so you have like um idea what I'm trying to accomplish in this wedding. So first off, wedding is so expensive, so expensive. I'm like, for flowers, I, you know, I try to contact like vendors email email them and the the minimum that they're gonna charge you is the cheapest one that i like you know found was 3500 i'm like oh my gosh 3500 for minimum just their minimum payment and you know it depends on the arrangement of of the flowers that you want so I'm like your girl is not rich so you know I don't have the money for that but I'm trying to I will try to um, DIY my flowers so this space right here I'm gonna like insert pictures of the flowers I like um, house to set up the tables um you know just the general idea of my re wedding ins inspiration you know everything i got it from pinterest pinterest is my best friend you know <laughs> um yeah let's start with um like my ceremony vision vision board I'll insert a picture. So yeah, I just I just want a simple decorations. You know, I like if you can see in the picture I like just the cross and maybe like um put like linen and some garlands on it and then that's about it. Um and I wanna put like, you know, our welcome sign or I want to have like unplug ceremony because first you're gonna pay the 
photographer to like you know capture the moment and all of that and then some pictures that i saw like a lot of people like on their phones you know the photographer captured that and i don't know i just feel like oh i, I want to be in that moment with you guys with my family and friends you know i want i want you to be um part of this ceremony as well not just um like you know taking pictures i know they're they're part of it but um that's why the photographer is there to like to capture the moment right so yeah i like the idea of unplug unplug ceremony and i also like i'm looking down here because my my laptop is right here and then i want to do um like a chord ceremony like three chords and stuff like that and um i also like after you know the the officiant say that um you may kiss the bride and then like welcome uh the new the newly mr and mrs and then the, i want like petals like thrown at us and when we stop in the middle of the aisle so you know just for just for pictures i feel like it's so cute <laughs> And for like the decorations, I just want um, my color scheme is white. I just want everything white, like you know, for the flowers. I, I like you know greenery, but I feel like if I'm gonna do my my flowers, I feel like it's gonna be hard for me, you know, to like um, incorporate like a lot of greenery, a lot of flowers. So. I was thinking maybe baby's breath and white roses. I'll be showing you like, um, you know, my flower inspo and stuff like that. So let's proceed to reception inspo. I'll be putting pictures. So yeah, and um, I want to get a like a neon sign of our name. And then like a backdrop and then there's like flowers and then candles and the table just white I feel like it's so pretty if if you get like white super clean and then for the table center I want like gold like the pot where the flowers will be and then like white flowers um, like gold accents like candles like tea light candles and stuff like that and if the you know the venue the vendor that we will get I hope they have like the clear plate with round uh, like the rim gold rim and oh my gosh my hair <laughs> don't mind the hair um, like gold spoon and fork so I feel like it's so you know um, so classy timeless and then again for the flowers I might do the baby's breath and um, white roses but one in the corner top left corner there's like greenery that's that's what I want right there but I feel like I'm not professional florist and I'm not gonna pay you know a lot of money just to have flowers so I need to compromise yeah for the cake I just want like because it's just for me and Andrew for the uh, to cut for the pictures I'm planning if you know the vendor is the cake place will um, agree like maybe one or two layers of cake with gold like flakes and maybe like white flowers and then the rest will be cupcakes with gold flakes as well so i think that's gonna be okay for the dessert right because <laughs> i i don't know i want to i want to have like dessert table but i feel like it's at additional cost so um so i'll i might talk to the baker you know the cake baker if that if that's okay you know for the package 
So next, flowers and greenery. My, you know, my inspo. Um, yeah, there's um, dahlias, peonies, roses, baby's breath, seeded eucalyptus, um, silver dollar eucalyptus, and like the spiral one. Those are the those are the ones that I want for my you know for the bouquet centerpieces and stuff like that. But like what I've said, I uh, I'm planning to do my flowers. I don't want to make it hard for me because I'm gonna make the flowers the day before the wedding. So um, our wedding might be in Sunday, so I'll be doing the whole day like doing the flowers and all of that. Saturday so you know I don't want to um I don't want to make it hard for me for for my br bridal party to have like very difficult flower arrangement and of course I have two kids to like take care of so I'm trying to DIY a lot of stuff in this wedding <laughs> okay next slide the neutral color theme I want this theme my theme is like white, gold, um, maybe like um, black for the layerings, for the decorations. But for the clothing, I want I want a uniform color. So this neutral color right here, I'll be adding to my um, invitations if the guests can. Um, do the dress code with same color as this so you know in the pictures um, I feel like it will be look good if that makes sense so I'll insert like a because I saw a video on TikTok that you know like dress code the dress code um, same color same at least like same neutral colors and it looks nice so I'm like I want to do that and then for my um, maid, maid of honor uh, bridesmaid, I'm planning to have on, only like two, like both my sisters. No bridesmaid, just maid of honor and a matron of honor, just my two sisters. Um, yeah, I'm, I want to have a, you know, the bouquet will be like baby's breath. With greenery or baby's breath with white roses and I also like like the um, silk kind of um, dress and I want their hair to be like um, down put down and nude or white heels is fine because I'm planning to have my you know my hair to be like low band so yeah I want their hair to be like down Next, for the groomsmen and spo, I want them um, to the second photo to the left. The guy is wearing like a suit, right? And then I want Andrew to wear a suit. It's either the his groomsmen will have this like vest or this, um, what do you call that like string? I don't know, but something like that to, to to be to be just you know different from Andrew. But I I wanted like same color like beige, and then I want a brown shoes, and for the boutonniere, I just want like a baby's breath or maybe like add some greenery. I don't know yet. Like what I said. I'm gonna make the bouquets, the boutonnieres, the centerpieces, the backdrop, and all of that. So I need to, <laughs> I need to um, plan this very hard and make it easy, you know, for people to help me out. Now for the flower girls and spouse, of course, I have two girls, so they're gonna be our flower girl. Um, no ring bearer, uh, just flower girl. Um, yeah, I like the, this like brown basket and then I'm just going to DIY and put some maybe fake, fake flowers on the side and then I want their hair to be down 
with down or just you know like a ponytail like that and then there's like a um headband right there and then i want their their dress to be like like a tutu like you know princess type thing their skirt and i'm looking for like long sleeve <clears throat> excuse me long sleeve um top um maybe i might find it on etsy but yeah i want it like super puffy dress and um i want with like a big bow but and then maybe gold or white shoes comment down below which one is better like gold or white so yeah that's for flower girls inspo and then for grooms inspo brand for andrew um like the beige suit brown shoes um for his boutonniere i might um add like one white rose and then like greenery and then some of the baby's breath and then for bride bride inspo i like the long sleeve dress with like i don't know like florally lacy type thing and then i want it to be like like open in the back and then a white roses bouquet and then I just want for the makeup I just want like simple like a natural look it's not like natural like this I mean I don't wear makeup all the time but I don't want to like I don't want like super dark makeup if that makes sense because I don't wear makeup all the time so I don't want to be like who is she you know I still want to look like me, if that makes sense. Yeah, and then I uh, I really want that shoes, the Amina Muadi shoes, like the transparent with like um, design in, in the front. It, but it's so expensive, like it's like $3,000 tax included. I'm like, nope, I'm not going to spend that kind of like you know money just for shoes so you know I'm, i've been looking for amazon ross marshall's like dupe for that look so i'm still for i'm still looking i'll be sharing with you like hauls and stuff like that when i get some stuff so the last one for now is the flower arrangements um yeah i really like with the greenery and stuff like that but i feel like it's gonna be hard so this one in the middle like with the with their name and that's baby's breath with roses but uh, it looks really nice i i kind of like it so and then in the bottom left for the center pieces it looks really nice and it looks clean so i might i might do that so yeah, that's you know my inspo for uh, for the wedding. So um, like what to DIY? I'm planning to DIY my welcome sign, my seating chart, my unplug ceremony, my invitation, the save the date because we're already June. So we might send it like through email, text, or whatever, Facebook Messenger. Um, for people that we're trying to invite, and then we're going to do the invitations, the proper invitations, the formal invitations. The invitations, I'll do it myself. I'll do it in Canva, no biggie. And then what else? I'll do my table numbers. I'll do my... Um, I think the flowers, the flower basket, the flower girl basket. What else? Um, the place card. I'll do everything. You know, <laughs> even if I'll do the um, even the dessert table if I can, or the photo booth. So we're still like on the process of planning all this um, things. So you know, I just wanna um, share it with you guys and be with me to this journey of planning to our wedding i'm so excited 
if you haven't watched our um, the proposal, I'm gonna link it in the card. Um, what else? I don't know. I'm just excited for the planning and all that. Uh, I know it's gonna be expensive, expensive, really expensive, but you know, you're just gonna. Hopefully, we're just gonna get married once, you know, but yeah, I feel like marriage, marrying your best friend is a big deal and it should be celebrated, so, with family and friends, so, yeah, we're not gonna invite, like, a lot of people, um, you know, family for sure, and maybe some close friends, that's all. The top max would be like 100, 150. 150 is like, I feel like it's too much. But, um, oops, hold on. But yeah, that's, what do you think, guys? Leave, leave it, leave your comments down below. Um, do you like the theme, the colors and all? I feel like, you know, some people go for like colorful, like lavender, pinks. Um, like boho type I don't know I just feel like maybe 10 years from now you know that's trendy now like the boho style that's trendy now but what if 10 years from now or when I get old I'm like I don't want to regret you know I just want to go with the timeless classic wedding so what do you think leave your thoughts down below so that's pretty much it for today's video i hope you like it give this a thumbs up if you do consider subscribing to my channel and hit that notification bell to be notified every time i post a video if you have mommy video suggestions leave it in the comment section to be featured on my comment of the day salamat at mahal ko kayo and i'll see you in my next video bye